Welcome back to Data Cloud Now. I'm back on the show floor at Snowflake Summit where I'm delighted to be joined by Keith Bellinger, product evangelist at SQL DBM. Keith, such a pleasure to be with you here today. It's a pleasure to be here. Thanks for having me. At SQL DBM, you are a leading collaborative cloud-based modeling solution for the enterprise with over 300,000 users and still growing. Yeah. How is your product strategy putting your customers' needs at the forefront? And are any trends emerging? So right now, much the same approach that Snowflake has, we've started from the cloud up, right? Building on the cloud, making those capabilities that the modern data practices are looking to expect, right? Not something on an on-prem solution, but something that's built from the cloud so that you can have multiple people across your organization all working on SQL DBM, modeling, collaborating, and growing their own businesses and you know, leveraging SQL DBM to do all that work. It's great to hear, and at the end of the day, the, the great results across the ecosystem. Clearly the excitement and buzz is all around us. During your time here at Summit, Keith, what's top of mind and what are you looking forward to? Well, top of mind for, for me, I mean, obviously AI is like the talk, you know, ML, and so really getting people to understand the role data modeling plays. I mean, your AI or ML is only going to be as good as the data that's feeding into it. So having good modeled, structured data, understanding your data, so that you get more effective in those AI. So, you know, a lot of people, where do we fit in that space? And that's really what we're trying to get them to understand is a lot of people have abandoned the thought of data modeling and its importance, so you just want it to build, build, but now getting to understand that putting that structure together and understanding the structure is just going to make the more effective building out those AI and ML models. Keith, great insights, thank you so much for that. How is the AI data cloud helping SQL DBM power modern frameworks and methodologies? A lot of what we're doing is allowing organizations to put those boilerplates, those templates, so that they can accelerate those methodologies, trying to get everybody in your organization to understand you know, those patterns and things like that. So being able to get those patterns, those frameworks, you know, by your senior architects or whatever, so that the other people can adopt those and leverage them across their organization to accelerate, improve quality, time to market, are all the things that we're trying to help organizations do because the faster we go, the faster they even want it, right? And so, it continues to yeah. evolve and adapt. Yeah. SQL DBM brings everything you need at your client's fingertips. Can you walk us through how it works for the audience watching here today? Yeah, so, it's simple, it starts with your web browser. You get to your web browser. If, if you're just starting out and organizations want to understand what's inside, Snowflake can reverse engineer that in, see all their data structures, how they relate to one another. But then after that, if they want to continue their design, you know, you can have it so that one modeler, one engineer, multiple ones can all be contributing to that. We allow that you can do concurrent working, you know, separate branches in your data modeling. Um, if people want to do governance and they want to add metadata to that, and then also, you know, today we just announced that we're introducing the ability to do transformational modeling. Congratulations, yeah, it's so, all happening here at yeah, Snowflake Summit. Now we're allowing us people not only design your data structures inside SQL DBM, but now actually develop the code and leveraging the power of Snowflake with SQL DBM together to then populate those tables all in one solution. It's an exciting next yes, chapter. Yes, absolutely. Keith, yeah. such a pleasure having yes. you on the program today. Yes, thank you thank so you much. Thank you very much. Yeah.